Hi, it's Reggie, and today I will be reacting to another Angelica Hale. I can't get get enough of this kid's voice and talent and performance. Let's take a look of what she's gonna be singing. This is from three months ago. Okay, here we go. Yep. <laughs> Welcome back, everyone. Being a parent can be tough, but it's all worth it when we see our kids happy and doing things they love. That's why I love this next segment. It is called Proud Parent, brought to you by Mega Floors. Today, we're thrilled to be joined by Eva and her daughter, Angelica, and Angelica's piano teacher, Dr. Warren Woodruff. Welcome, everyone. Welcome back. Hi. So good to see you. Welcome, doctor. Great to see you. All right. Uh, catch everyone up. You were on the show, gosh, was it a year ago? Yeah, that was like about a year ago. ago. Yeah. And talk about her love of music and when this all first started. Oh, I mean, yeah, she's been traveling now. Yeah, like uh, with the uh, benefits uh, of uh, Children's uh, Miracle Network. Oh, uh -huh. yeah. But give everyone the story of what happened to her health-wise oh. that impacted her. Yeah, she, um, she had a double pneumonia, and um, yeah, and her kidney got infected, and then she had to go through dialysis, hmm. and then um, and then. Uh, uh, two years from now, she had a uh, kidney transplant. A transplant. Yeah. And how have you been feeling since then, Angelica? Great. I know, because I follow you on Facebook, and I know you're doing so well traveling. And talk about where your love of music came from. Did it happen while you were experiencing all of your health issues or even before? Well, I think it was after because I experienced what the kids had experienced, and now my love of music and my inspiration comes from them. Aww. So what are you doing with CHOA, with Children's Health Care of Atlanta? Well, I'm traveling around the U.S., and my latest one, I think, was in ooh, Miss America. Oh, nice. <laughs> Way to sell that. Like, here it is, Miss America. And talk to me about what we're seeing there. Was that you on the stage? Yes, I was in the Momentum, and... I, it was for Children's Miracle Network Hospitals. In and, Orlando. Yeah. yeah, I was on New Orlando. And there is me singing at to Miss America. Fantastic. I know, it's so great. <laughs> <laughs> I loved it. There. Okay, uh, and uh, let's talk about, Dr. Woodruff, how you found Angelica and what, you know, were the reasons why you said this is just not a passing, you know, thing for her. This is a real gift, a real talent. Right, well, when I first met Angelica, it was last year at the Tower of talent that Michael Greenbaum has set an example for that we would love to copy all over the world yes. to raise money and then I, I heard Angelica's story and I heard her sing and I thought this is directly in line with my own mission with my book Dr. Fuddle and the Gold Baton of showing the healing yes. power of music yes. and how it can transform and how there's no end to the challenge that it can present to a child lifelong all right. once they discover it it's there forever for them and Angelica, you're going around now, you're raising money for Children's Health Care of Atlanta. Um, talk about really what was the inspiration for you. I know getting sick you wanted to help other kids, but that's a lot of commitment. Which you, you, This is something you really love then, huh? Yeah, I really love it. It's it's really important for me to raise money all around because Children's Health Care of Atlanta saved my life. That's incredible, and I know you're going to be involved in something that actually I'm going to be involved in as well. That is a Tower of Talent, and this year it is December, right? Yeah, yes. December 4th. December 4th on a Sunday. It's the perfect thing to do uh, to bring the kids, get all dressed up for the holidays, and, and bring them to a show that has talents like Angelica's and so many more kids performing all different types of things. Right? I didn't go last year, so it was not just singing, but musical instruments, all of that. Right, it's Doctor? It's going to be completely jaw-dropping. Uh, I've been um, pro, uh, the program co-chair for this this year, and we have a program set out that no one should ever miss. It's, it's unbelievable. The, the range of talent, everything from classical music to uh, Broadway and beyond that. And Angelica, of course, is one of our biggest stars for this. Yay! So you I just can't cannot wait. miss. You can't miss this. And I'm going to bring my daughters, and we're going to just be, we're going to be your biggest, loudest fans. How about that? <laughs> And all my okay. friends. Thank you. And all my friends. Aww. And all your friends. And uh, talk to me about what you're performing now. Well, now in the Tower of Town. For, today, for us, yeah. I'm going to be performing The Hills Are Alive with Dr. Warren. <gasps> Fantastic. Yay. Without further ado, take it away. Music 
wants to beat like the wings of the birds that rise from the lake to the trees. My heart wants to sigh like a chime that flies from a church on a breeze to laugh. The way she enunciates the words of the song itself, the fluidity of it, how she convey people per, per word, it's just amazing how she conveys me, especially me. I don't know the song that heals the song, it's with Judy Garland I think, or I don't know, probably I don't know my facts, but something from the classic song or a classic, a classical song from a movie or something like that but she just sang it to me like there's the heels of the sound of everything Angelica you cray we can be cray cray little girl mm -hmm. let's continue all right like a brook when it trips and falls over stones on its times does a girl like this memorize songs oh my gosh I can't even sing a song without a karaoke lyrics or something this girl's pure talent hey. I know I will hear what I've heard before my heart will be blessed say thank you for the music the songs are singing thanks for all the joy that you're bringing who can live without it but for all honesty what would life be without a song and a dance what are we so now i say thank you for the music for bringing it to me yay that's all i can support that's all I can add to that performance, performance of hers. And guys, I want to grow here as a YouTube um, commentator, a reaction video analyst or something. Please subscribe to my channel. Give this thing a like or comment any suggestions. Please, I want to make friends with you. I want to be a family to all of you. This has been Reggie Wade Palencia reporting to you live or acting video reacting to you live via my room background or whatever. There's no background at all. Have a wonderful day. Be safe. I love you all. Bye-bye.